Hey Simlates, it's Deligracy here with Let's Play The Sims 4 Vampires Part 5 and man, we're only up to Part 5. We really need to get kicking on, don't we? Oh wow, what is with that sourpuss face? Come on girl, come on girl. Uh, but in the other part, we had a little bit of a sad thing happen. Uh, Harlow met this boy that she's kind of into uh, that goes to her school when she and her vampire family made her raid his house with them. Uh, to drink here. their plasma. Now, Sebastian she here, who she has a little bit of a crush on, she um, was very devastated because Elvira, her vampire mother, Elvira actually got carried away and killed his mother with her vampire powers and from drinking her plasma. So she passed away, and since then, he's actually said to her that he wants to hang out with her. So it's kind of awkward because she's like, slowly getting interested in this guy and then realizing that she's actually his biggest danger. Now, a lot of you guys were saying he should now become a vampire hunter, him and his father, to get back at Elvira and not realize that Harlow uh, is a part of that family. Like, he didn't recognize her, perhaps, in her vampire outfit. So I think we're going to make her maybe go into Kaz, create a sim, and make her more unrecognizable in her vampire outfit because she doesn't want him to ever recognize her when she's in that dark form which I thought was kind of a cool idea the other thing was I was reading your comments there was some fantastic ideas you guys like I'm so impressed uh Kennedy Smith was the one who said the boys who mm, whose mother's whose mother died should become a vampire hunter to avenge his mom's death but he falls in love with Harlow and later realizes what she really is and that got 562 thumbs up from you guys so that's you guys are keen and uh Isaac said can we make Harlow's family and like put it as a hashtag deligracy please because I got a good backstory for them you guys are always welcome to upload any inspiration you have for any LP of mine onto the gallery under the hashtag deligracy I check it quite regularly so feel free to do that if you feel inspired. Uh, and just keep simming, said Deli, get Hollo to hang garlic in her room so she can't bite people. And Olga said maybe even grow some garlic so she can try to make the sun resistance potion at some point or even cure herself. So I thought that was cool. I didn't even realize there was a sun like resistance potion we could make, but it's clear to me that we need to maybe change Harlow's traits to get into gardening. Girl, don't do that. You'll give it away. <laughs> Not that her teeth doesn't already do that. I actually kind of have vampire teeth sometimes. In some pictures, it looks like I have vampire teeth. You guys have, you, some of you guys have commented on that. <laughs> Now, how are, we, how are we actually doing? I mean, we're getting really thirsty, so we do need to go home. Our energy's down as well. But how is our relationship with Sebastian? I mean, we're definitely friends. I feel like we could maybe... Uh, I mean, it's 8 p.m. Let's go over here. Let's, let's maybe get a little bit romantic on the chessboard uh, and have a little flirtation with him and let things become a little deeper. Also, how much do you wish that these objects were available in the Build and Buy catalog? Like, I would love these trees. Can you guys please make them available? <gasps> you know what? I'm going to tweet the Sims. I'm going to tweet them. And I'm going to take a picture right now for us to tweet and be like, can these please be made into real items? Love them. Uh, so, yeah. There were also some really cool plot lines and storylines that I was kind of obsessed with that you guys posted. There's like too many to go through. But yeah, I'm impressed. I'm impressed. So keep them coming. Keep them coming. Uh, also, if we do want Harlow to become a human at some point, if we want her to cure herself, she needs to craft the vampire cure cocktail that can only be crafted by Sims with a level 15 vampire lore skill and requires 10 of wolfsbane, garlic, and plasma fruit. So we need to get her good at gardening and the vampire lore skill if we want to even consider that. So I think she's going to become a bit more of a bookworm. Oh, no, they're so uncomfortable. I don't know if this is a good opportunity for flirting. I mean, we can try. We can try. Uh, maybe do a little bit of an inside joke and do a little bit of a romance. Maybe flirt. Just like a little flirtation. This is so romantic that they're on a chessboard. This, I wish this happened to me. I want to be in this game. Okay, goodbye. That's fine. We'll go home. It, 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 we'll come back to the chessboard another time. It can be their spot. 
it can be that special spot. Goodbye, Sebastian. Thank you so much for for that coffee. It was lovely, even though I almost burnt to death. My God. Oh, I love when they go through this little section. This is uh, really clever how they did this, I thought. Apparently, it was quite sophisticated to do that. Anyways, fly home, buddy. Fly home. All right, let's see if the plasma tree on the property, where is it? Oh, good. It looks like it's harvestable. Maybe she can go get that plasma fruit. Yes, awesome, which means she can grow some as well. Actually, one of you guys also said maybe she should have like a secret garden where she grows her plasma fruit. I wonder if there's any space on the property for us to kind of do that. Oh, um, excellent. Okay, so in our inventory, we've got 10 of those. Eat plasma fruit. Well, it's not going to be hard to get those. Oh my god. I love how she just sticks a straw in and is like, mmm, tasty. <laughs> how quickly does that fill up her thirst? Uh, it's not as effective as drinking plasma from a sim. But... Oh my god, yeah, you have to have a lot of them to fill up your thirst. She was so hungry. She's like, oh, that coffee was disgusting that that boy gave me. Oh, okay, we'll have another one. And that should get her. Maybe we should take her back to full. And she really needs to have some hygiene and a little bit of fun. Girl needs a bit of fun in her life. Like, it's all so serious. Why so serious? Mmm, plasma. Uh -huh. That fruit actually looks really yummy, despite it actually technically kind of being like the equivalent to blood. I'd totally eat that. I wouldn't have blood though. That creeps me out. That's just, even thinking about that, I'm kind of like, ugh. Someone was trying to tell me blood is good for you. I'm like, damn girl, that, that'd be messed up. <laughs> uh, harvest. Okay, it's still growing. Okay, this should fill you up. Man, plasma fruit kind of sucks for getting your thirst done. Okay, now let's get her to have a quick shower. Oh, I feel like when she comes home, Elvira would be like, where were you, Harlow? Where have you been? Did you meet a nice vampire boy, perhaps? <laughs> dag, dag. Holly's like, hi, mother. Bomb. Even though I never want to call you mom, ever. <laughs> what are the vampire options? Command to clean, command to repair, command to sit, command to work out. <gasps> what an awful mother. She'd be so jealous of Harlow, maybe, because she can have kids. Wait, can Harlow have kids? No, Harlow can't have kids either. Maybe if she gets jealous of Harlow, she'd be like, you need to work out more, because you're getting chubby or something and be that kind of awful mother who would do that even though Harlow's perfectly perfect. Now, okay, let's just, let's not get distracted. Let's get Harlow into that bathtub. Uh, maybe take a thoughtful shower. She can think about how she needs to get into reading and gardening and hence why we're then going to change her traits. Oh, I love this build, by the way, if I don't say so myself, but I just love how different this is to all of my other houses. Um, it just gets me excited playing in it. Anyways, uh, Elvira, now, how is she going with her study and vampire law skill? Vampire law, she's up to level eight. That is awesome. That's really cool. Uh, I mean, that's not her. Oh, whoops, that's Dante. Dante is up to that. He needs to continue his research to unlock more vamp. Oh, I gotcha, I gotcha. Search for information. Ooh, purchase mosquito trap seeds. <gasps> Plasma fruit seeds. What? We can just purchase them from the computer? Can we do that? Order plasma packs. Mm, see, she's not quite as skilled. Is she skipping? Oh, no, he's working out. That's fine. Uh, Elvira, do you want to read uh, volume two, I think? Yeah, read volume two, uh, please, yes, honey yes. buns. And blades. He's just getting fit. He's thirsty, though. He's super thirsty. He needs to go bite some humans already. Is there any any humans stupid enough to be walking around at night? Oh, yes. Vampire. Cannot drink from another vampire. 
Vampire cannot drink from another vampire. We need more humans to to spawn in here. We don't have time to go wandering into like Willow Creek. We want vampires here and we want them now. Ooh, what's that? Hmm. You know, it's probably really easy to find all the ingredients. We just need to up our reading skill. You know what? Let's not do that. Let's maybe, uh, we'll have a shower, then we might go hunting. Might go a hunting. And uh, I think what we'll do for you, Missy, is your vampire energy is low. But what I want to do is get you to go to create a sim and make a few changes now that she's had a thoughtful shower. Elvira read that frogs are a valuable source of materials for creating your own plasma packs. <gasps> That is so cool. We can make plasma packs out of frogs. Mm -hmm. Pice there. <laughs> oh dear. Oh God, that legitimately just scared me a little bit. Okay, so first of all, I think what we need, oh damn it, we can't change our traits because we need cats or full at it. Maybe we'll start reading and over time we can, she can get more into reading. I mean, she looks pretty different already. Like, maybe she looks different enough. Maybe she can hide her hair color. Maybe her hair can go gray. Blonde. <sighs> Pink. Purple. I kind of like the red hair there. It suits her so well. But gray would probably make her less recognizable than she already is. Or is... The red's a bit of a giveaway. Let's just keep her hair gray, I think. I think that's fine. Uh, and then that'll be the hmm. same for all of these. Yeah. yeah that's okay. That's good. I mean, the choke is a little bit of a giveaway. But I think the rest is fine. The rest is fine. Okay. Uh, I don't mind this outfit. I might be starting to get a little sick of it though. So let's let's give her a few other options. Now maybe we could put this with like a little skirt thing or something. Oh, little short shorts. Although she'd want to cover up her skin as much as possible. So yeah, maybe we can like, mm, I'm not a huge fan of those. Just go these. Hmm. Although she wants to be normal, so maybe she wouldn't wear stuff like that. Maybe she would wear something. What is? Is that new? Uh -huh. That is new. That is definitely new. <laughs> maybe she can just wear this with um some like zippy pants. Zippity zip pants. I don't mind the patchwork ones. They're kind of cool. They're kind of nifty. And you know what? Let's just change the color of her top. Just for something a little fresh. We'll go for the blood red or plasma red color. I wear his blade. Oh, blade. He's making a friend. I just want him to have a friend, you know. Brood about being a vampire. And maybe they can duel and do vampire things together. Oh, he needs to be in a better emotional state. Okay. Let's just go get him, we need to get him some blood, I mean plasma. Let's just go here, let's go to Desert Bloom. I think he'll be okay by himself, unless he wants to bring Caleb with him, which he kind of hates, so I don't know. Hopefully they can get along. I suppose Blade would, it be, would be pretty standoffish to begin with. I don't think he'd be the warmest person. I mean, he probably is cold-blooded. Does he even have blood? <laughs> Aha! Uh -huh. Drink the plasma. Just go for it. Ew! You stanky boy! You stank. Yuck. Huh? This is probably like his school friend. Maybe when they drink from them, they don't remember that they're a vampire. Or they just don't recognize them. Look at that! We had to eat like 20 plasma fruits for Harlow to to actually get 
anywhere with her thirst. And he just has one deep, compelled suck on this guy's blood, and it goes straight up to the top. Not bad. I'm impressed. Apologize. Maybe because he's in a better mood. He's like, I'm sorry. Caleb, let's be friends. Request vampiric training. I doubt he's going to train us when we've been so rude to him. They look like they could be friends, though. Was that a yes? Was that a yes? Make a vampire pun? Oh, please don't. Oh, I think they are training right now. That's awesome. Nice. Blade de Drod is now a minor vampire. He has started the ascent to the unhallowed rank of Grandmaster. Oh, you know, I reckon he would be pretty ambitious getting up to... Getting up to ma Master Vampire. I reckon he'd be into that. Who's down here? I wonder if there's any girls for him to like. Felicia. Oh, Felicia. Lince. Well, maybe... I don't know. No ball. Show of powers? That'll get his skill up a little bit. He's super strong. Actually, I really want him to get... What is his power points up to? Can he have extreme muscle strength yet? Vampire strength! Yes! Win fights more often and work out more efficiently. Love that. Sold. Wait, what? Deselect current power and return to wallet. What? Oh my god, we can get two of those? We can get two. So that means unlocks the ability to crush metals and crystals into elements. <gasps> that is so cool. Not only are you vastly superior in combat, you can crush raw elements into refined mineral samples with your bare hands. Oh, and that's how he makes his money, maybe. I love that, but we have to take a weakness. Gains less thirst when drinking, makes the sun more harmful than normal. Blade vomits when eating human foods, becomes guilty when drinking from Sims without permission. Uh, I the hissing or the throw up you know this is an easy one i think we can take that that's fine yes honey nice one blade winning all right let's head home because i want to see the others let's go blade let's go bladey let's go i'd say that was a successful feeding you know we got some new powers he's got super strength he can crush metals with his bare hands that's hot. Oh, become best friends forever. Absolutely. What? They're actually close? So he really cares about her. He really cares about her and really wants her to be a vampire with him. I thought they kind of disliked each other. Guess not then. But the main thing is he's stanky. So I want you boys to take a bubble bath. Like seriously. And Harlow, how? You've got four power points. Uh, what about... Let's see. We don't really have many options, do you? Yeah, we're not going for any of those. We want to get some cool stuff for you. Uh, did you read the book while we were gone? I'm actually still level four. Well, I think what we'll do is... Should we... Uh, do we want a quick nap? Yeah, let's have a quick nappy. Let's go for a quick nap. Uh, or hibernation, rather. Go down there. Hibernate. Thank you very much. Uh, he's going to have a shizwell. And then he can, oh, I've forgotten which colors are who. Oh, well, he can hibernate. Uh, Dante's getting a little bit thirsty. They really lose hygiene quickly, these vampires. <laughs> Is that a thing? I don't know. Uh, and Elvira, maybe it's time Elvira gets a job <laughs> of some kind. Oh my God, she'd be crazy. She'd be so crazy. I wonder if anyone has a baby in this town. Oh, hmm. Zilnoi. <laughs> Zilnoi. Maybe she can go break into some houses and see if there's a baby anywhere. Like, hold on. Let's, let's actually, 
Let's go to Manage Worlds and see what babies are in town because I could see us stealing someone's baby. They don't have a baby, they don't have a baby. Vlad definitely don't have a baby. Having a mother who hates children is quite difficult. Cynthia has always been focused on one person, only herself. Even when her son was born, she'd rather have fun and focus on her own success. But she's fallen in love and now gives her attention to her boyfriend. Unfortunately, she's now pregnant and her son, Blake, only hopes his mother will give his new sibling the love and attention that it deserves. Now, that was made by a simile, which I thought was kind of cool. Where's the other baby? I swear there was another one. This one. It's this. Ramiro, the single father of Matias and Jared Jars, after their mother was murdered, the case is still ongoing and nobody knows who has killed her. Ooh. Matias is a kind-hearted teen who loves to explore the outdoors. He hasn't quite found that special someone to share his love of nature with. Hello, hello, but he hopefully will find that girl. He's also a very popular student at his local high school and hopes to make plenty of friends. The backstory for the Deligracy Vampires Let's Play. Skills included. I like that. Hmm. Well, I think that baby, I'm guessing Jared is a guy. So maybe we'd go steal the baby and she'd be like, well, the mother didn't even want it. Or something and appear to be like all totally innocent even though she's totally not getting hot in here so take off all your clothes i am getting so hot i want to take my clothes off okay oh hello friends friendly introduction we'll act all nice to begin with and then we really need to get inside real quick uh let's just go for a for a deep drink let's get straight down to business and we don't want her in the house while we take a baby so damn that girl is she is tight uh-oh what happened why didn't that work wait 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 oh my god she doesn't have enough energy to do this okay we're just gonna have to go for a vampiric entrance vampiric entrance girl oh can we just fly here as bad okay good thank god oh what what did she is she in is she oh that was okay how do we i can't even see her knock on door Oh, good grief. Okay, fine. We're in. We're in. Oh, this is a nice little house. I quite like this. Okay, what we can do to just get a little bit of power back up is quickly vampire dark meditation. Just a sneaky one. Get that vampire energy back. Yes, girl. Okay, cool. Now we can go back over here and she's like, ah, there is a human in my bathroom. I mean, uh, not a human. <laughs> you know what I mean. Uh, 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 command to leave because we're going to take your baby. Command to leave, woman. Oh, wait. We wanted to drink your blood, though. <laughs> Did it work? Oh, my God. I can hear the baby. She's probably like... Ugh. I can hear a baby. I will drink your blood, and then I will take your baby and become its, its, its mother, because I always wanted a baby. Oh, it's so graphic, isn't it, for The Sims? Like, I find the sound effects in that really creepy. I don't know about you guys, but it is creepy AF. Damn, girl, she going for it. <laughs> okay. Good night. Thanks for that. Uh, she outie.